Two Fort Wayne school districts saw a total of four bus crashes in just over a week. And while no one was killed, a couple people were injured. Fox 55's Brianna Bias is live in Fort Wayne to tell us more about what happened. Brianna. Yeah, Kelsey, you know what they say. Once is an accident, twice is a coincidence, and three is a pattern. But this has happened four times in the last eight days. And Fort Wayne Community Schools doesn't understand it because they think their school buses stand out as bright yellow signals to drive carefully. Lincoln Elementary parent Deanna has been concerned about school zone speeders for a long time. Just have patience, like there's no need. I see people not using even signals. And the recent school bus crashes certainly haven't made her feel any better. Three Fort Wayne Community School buses and one Southwest Allen County School bus were involved in crashes in the last eight days. Across the state, we receive a lot of these small bus crashes. Obviously, a lot of them don't make the media. We don't like to say they're common. Obviously, it's a large yellow bus. It should be difficult to run into, uh, but people still seem to find a way. Indiana State Police Trooper Wes Rollator says school bus crashes happen more often than you'd think. They just don't all happen in one week. If you're driving and you see a yellow school bus, it's time to pay attention and drive in a way that your kids are on that bus. Krista Stockman with Fort Wayne Community Schools says no children were injured in any of their crashes, but two of their drivers and one assistant driver were taken to the hospital. And while Stockman is relieved they will all recover fully, both the drivers and the buses will need a little time off work to recover. Having uh, you know a couple more drivers who are taking some time off to recover uh, doesn't help with our driver shortage, but we also want them, of course, to take the time that they need to heal. She says the school district does have some backup buses, so they'll be able to complete their routes as usual. And while Rollator says occasional crashes are inevitable, drivers can avoid them by being more attentive and obeying the bus's flashing lights. If a school bus has yellow lights flashing, it means soon they're going to turn red and that stop arm is going to come out. It's okay to be late, you know? I'm always late. <laughs> And as the weather continues to cool down, we're going to start seeing more of that fog early in the mornings. So Rollator says to keep your eyes up, slow your vehicle way down, and pay close attention. Live in Fort Wayne, I'm Brianna Bias, Fox 55 News. Always a good reminder about safety. Thanks so much for that report, Brianna.